بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على نبينا محمد وعلى عليه وصحبه وسلم أما بعد حبة في الله قال نبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى عليه وسلم إن حديث قدسي قال صلى الله عليه وسلم لما قد الله خلق كتب في كتابه على نفسه فهو موضوع عنده إن رحمتي تغلب غدبي رواه مسلم The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi wa sallam said in a hadith which he related relayed from his Lord subhanahu wa ta'ala He said لَمَا قَدَ اللَّهُ خَلْقُ When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala uh, decreed or created the creation كَتَبَ فِي كِتَابِهِ عَلَى نَفْسِي He wrote in a book about himself you know upon himself subhanahu wa ta'ala وَهُوَ مَوْضُوعٍ عِنْدُهُ and he in this book is is with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in rahmati taghlibu ghaddi bi verily my mercy supersedes my wrath ahabta fi Allah there is no doubt we're in need of the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so in fact that's really glad tidings for us as believers in Allah Azza wa Jal that we need his subhanahu wa ta'ala his mercy he is a rahman a rahim and he is al ghafur al wudu he is the all forgiving and the the all loving al wudu and he is also shadid al iqab he also is severe in his torment meaning that when those people who will be tormented by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, there's nothing in this dunya which is equivalent to his, his punishment and his wrath. However, the glad tidings that we can be thankful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and grateful to him about, as, as he said, in the rahmati taghlibu ghaddibi, verily my mercy supersedes my wrath. That Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has both mercy and he has wrath. And there is no comparison to his mercy and there's no comparison to his wrath. However, Allah Azza wa Jal, between those sifat that he subhanahu wa ta'ala possesses, he lets us know tabarak wa ta'ala. As is in this hadith of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, that his mercy supersedes his, his wrath. So he is more merciful than he is as far as compared to punishing his servants. Why is this glad tidings? Because no doubt we need the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. None of us want to experience the wrath of Allah Azza wa Jal, even though we are deserving of punishment because we have so many sins, we have so many wicked deeds we do. We, we are so unjust to one another. We oppress, we mislead, we misguide, we make so many mistakes. And so we are in need of the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase us in, with His mercy and, and encompass us with His mercy and His continued favor and blessings. May Allah forgive us of our many, many sins and help us to be better slaves of His.